In this video, I will show you how to create a simple seeding bottle or photo manipulation using Photoshop. So let's get started. So first, you open your Photoshop application, go to File and go to New. Set your width to 8 and the height to 8. Make sure that it is in inches and you leave the resolution at 300. Click OK when you are done. Now the first thing that I would like to do is add a solid color, change the color from white to something like gray and I'm using this color here so you can use it too. You click OK when you are done. Now I'm going to import my resources right from here. You just bring it into Photoshop. I press C on my keyboard and then I'll make the necessary Croppings. Now, when you are done, you click here and then you can press Ctrl 0 to zoom to fit. Now, double click on the background layer to create a new layer and then you click OK. Select your magic one tool and press anywhere that is white. So it makes a selection of all the whites in the bottle layer and then you click delete to get that get rid of that so you press ctrl d when you are done now since we don't want this part i'm going to make use of the polygonal lacto tool you make a selection over here And then you click delete when you are done. Press Ctrl D to deselect. Now send your bottle to the new layer that you created, the new document. And then you press Ctrl T to resize it. So you position it very nicely like this. You can scale it down a little bit. Something like this. Now the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to import my seedling right from here and then i will just leave it on top of my layer now i'm going to right click and select rasterize layer i'll go to pick my magic one to click anywhere that is white and then i'm going to delete it i'll press ctrl d when i'm done now press ctrl t to resize your seedling and position it very nicely inside your bottle something like this now the next thing that i'm going to do is i'm going to add a layer mask to it but this time around i'll hold alt and i'll click on the layer mask i'll therefore press my b on my keyboard to select my brush make sure that the foreground color is white and then you make sure that you selected this layer if you make a selection of this layer by pressing ctrl and then left clicking on it so you go ahead and then you brush on it like this so you brush the areas that you want the areas that you you don't want you leave it so you just brush and then you leave the rest and you are done so basically that's how to do this manipulation and i hope this tutorial helped you a lot if you did i hope you give it a like and then you subscribe to my channel for more videos bye